everything in order? Yep. Cindy, you have seriously outdone yourself. Yeah, never thought I'd see the day. And yet, here we are. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's take your first spin. Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. Ah, <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no reason you can't pay them a visit anytime you please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! <laughs> uh, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own wheels. Want to hit up the crow's nest? If you wish to put on weight, certain. Yeah, I know. You all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, thank you kindly. We'll take it out of the trunk so you all just sit tight. Stuff. Had a boy. A dog can really track a scent. Certainly knows how to find us. How do you always know, boy? <sighs> Just a sec. Nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah. Sill blossoms. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure. That's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> you don't say. Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden. Uh, hold on a sec, sir. I found an envelope addressed to Meldasio inside the package. Meldasio? The Hunter HQ? Yes, sir. The headhunter ought to be around here somewhere. Mind making one more delivery? What do you say, Noct? Might as well while we're in the neighborhood.
Well, look who it is. I really owe you boys one. Make that two. <laughs> Can't seem to catch a break. Yeah. yeah, looks like they found another one. Wait, uh... Found another what? Tag. Us hunters keep them on our person at all times as identification. What, in case you forget who you are? More like so no one else forgets who they were. Hunters lead a life of danger. Sometimes these tags are the only things that make it back in one piece. It's our job to deliver them to the families of the fallen. As it were, I came out here to do just that. <sighs> if y'all happen to find any tags lying around out there, would you do me a favor and send them my way? Yeah, sure. Word is, somebody spotted a tag around these parts. Try asking the local tipster. He'll point you in the right direction. Those tags are heavy stuff. They certainly carry emotional weight. We'd best find and return them. And give the families peace of mind. Let's start by following up on that hot tip. Ready or not? Oh, love the lighting. Now the question on everyone's mind. Who is Prince Noctis? His heart and features belie a gentle demeanor. Welcome to the crow's nest. What would you like? Happy to tell you about the area. Have a look at the menu. Can do. Look out, stomach. Thanks for your business. So we fill up the gas tank now, take our tea. So, uh, you think in a fairy tale, Lady Lunafreya back to the Crown City? Nah, no need to rush to happily ever after. Wow. Still can't believe you're actually tying the knot, dude. How does it feel now that it's finally happening? Fine, I guess. Ah, uh, come on, you can't fool me. Any guy would be over the moon to marry her. No big deal. Yeah, whatever. Came from there. Oh. Cut it out, man. Maybe... this way? This will make a fine paint.
Watch yourself, no! I know. Oh, yeah! Found one already, huh? You done good. Just picking up the pieces, I guess. Well, try to keep your spirits up. Even though I ain't one to talk, I beat myself up over the lives of the hunters I couldn't save. That's what each one of these tags means to me. They hurt. But if I let that greed keep me from looking for them, then their tags and their lives will be forgotten forever. And that'd hurt more than anything. Yeah, guess you're right. Well, that's why I tell all my hunters to collect any tag they see, and I expect you boys to go out and do the same. Huh. What's the forecast? Clear skies, with the temperature rising. Nice. For our next story, Lady Lunafreya of Tenebrae has issued an official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace, nor the pride I take in my betrothal playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages as you always have, and I shall continue to bless you all. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming days. Please be advised that during this time alone, her duties as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And Noctier likes the idea. What's that? I do? Buzz off. I see it too. That's Golden Key. Kind of want to go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. Nobody goes to Golden for an island, though. They go to kick back and get massages. And save with the seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. Here we are. Nice.
That's it. What's what? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> Can't wait to try it. Take a shot from here. Good call. Now it's picture time. Uh, let me get this shot. Oh, love the lighting. Hello and welcome. Please come again. My tummy's rumbling. What's all this about the port closing? Some kind of... Welcome to Golden Key. I'm afraid you're out of luck. Are we? The boats bring you here. What about them? Well, they'll not take you forth. And what's your story? I'm an impatient traveler, ready to turn ship. The ceasefire's getting us nowhere. What's this? Some sort of souvenir? <gasps> they make those? What? No. Consider it your allowance. Uh huh? Yeah. And who's allowing us? A man of no consequence. Mm. Oh. Yeah, right. Oh. Oh. You believe what that guy said about the port being closed? I'm skeptical, though I won't discount the possibility. I say we go check it out for ourselves. Hope everything will be up and running by morning. Absolutely breathtaking. Yes, I was about to say the same. We'll be fine as long as we're at a haven. Welcome to the Mother of Pearl. We use the freshest fish in every dish. You do know this is a restaurant. No end of headaches, this lot. Take a look at the menu. Thank you for your patronage. <laughs> Thinking about checking it out? Not at all. Looks like fun to me. Then you go. My mind's already open. Pronto, then. My tummy's rumbling. What's all this about the port closing? Out of service, indeed. Ah, man. A ship in sight. What gives? Now that's a meal. According to my sources, the Empire given strict orders not to let any vessels leave the docks of Altitia. Real shame if you were late to your own wedding, right, Prince Noctus? Name's Dino, by the way. Pleasure. The Crown Prince of Lucis bounty hunting in his fancy car. Surely you didn't think it'd go unnoticed. At least not by this reporter. Lucky for you, this reporter has integrity. If you want to remain incognito, I'll respect your wish. In exchange for a favor. What do you want? Hey, I knew you'd come around. Let me see your map. Marked where you need to go on your map. All you gotta do is find me some rough gemstones, like this one. 
Do this, and your ship will come in. Don't, and the papers will run you out of town. Capiche? What's all this about the port closing? Some kind of holdup in Altitia. Guess we have to stay in. This bites? How am I supposed to make my deliveries? Ooh, he's really got your number, Knox. Huh. Not like we made much effort to keep it secret. Even if we had, the press always finds a way. We needn't befriend him, but we'd best not make him our enemy. Hey, buddy. What's up? Taking a little stroll? How come you're all alone? You must be hungry. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Hold on a sec. I'll find you something. Huh? Gotta come up with some cat food. Could always buy some. Or we could fish for some. Excellent idea. Let's go. Good here. We may well be in for a feast tonight. Think I'll play King's Knight in the meantime. Better not. His Highness will get sulky. off on the reeling. All right, this one's perfect. Huh? Great job, Noct.
About time for a new line, ain't it? It's not gonna last. Let that be a reminder to change the line early and often. Is this place amazing or what? The breeze is quite refreshing. Didn't think I'd enjoy the seaside this much. Well, it sounds like it's made a good first impression. Here you go. Caught fresh. <sighs> what? You don't like fish? No. Oh, you only like cooked fish. All right. Welcome to Golden Key. Hey, do you serve anything a cat might like? That the best pickup line you've got? What? No, I... Uh, there's this cat over there. <laughs> I'm only teasing. I have a feeling I know the feline you've got in mind. Let me whip something up. Paying customers come first, though, and someone just ordered the last fish on hand. Would you mind catching another one of these while I make their meal? I'll start on it right away. You know, this is really thoughtful of you, but be warned. Cats are clingy, and they're notoriously picky eaters, too. 
picky eaters. We don't say. When it comes to food, felines are quite finicky. So you are wise to entrust the cooking to me. Here. Uh, that was a long drive. Let's rest up while we can. All right, here you go. You're one spoiled cat. Aww, I think he likes you. I guess. Clawed his way into a heart. Might keep on clinging forever. The roads are perilous at night. Let us wait for morning. Yeah, sounds good. Seatbelts, everyone. Maybe Sid was right about your lack of dignity. You're one step above delivery, boy. Royal rank carries little weight outside the Ground City. Glad it's not weighing me down. Everybody out. <sighs> All kidding aside, this could be bad. So we'll just stay out of it. No, nah, it's cool. Let's go. All kidding aside, I hate you. Day. Uh, we got company. Misery loves company. This doesn't look too good. Quite the formidable foe indeed. Yes. Ah, 
That's it. What's up, Iggy? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> Can't wait to try it. Huh. Crash right here. You can remain awake long enough to eat. Well taken. Hey, this one's pretty good. I know. I dig it too. You two are the picture of friendship. <laughs> 